Marquette, I want to go into kickboxing and eventually the UFC, and I'm wondering how to look after my finances while I'm in full-time training. If he means look after his finances, that could mean how do you make sure that you're being a good steward of your capital, you know, managing it, saving appropriately, investing appropriately. Or you might be saying, how do I make sure that I'm growing my wealth, building a money machine while I'm training? Now, those are two different questions that can lead me to two different answers. But let me say, number one, general principle with money, certainly you should be saving 10% of everything. You should save your money so that your money can save you. So at least 10% of every dollar that comes into your hand should be saved. Number two, you always want to have a product-based business, meaning that if you go to sleep, you can continue selling products even while you sleep. That's something that I often teach to the saints, especially during consultations. I got a message today from one of my youngins who did a consultation. We created a product. I won't tell you what it is. It's actually a women's product, and he's been selling it, and he got his first sale. That's so exciting because he's only been at the business for a week, right? So it's a beautiful thing to see him being able to make his first sale. If you're a hustler, making your first sale is like, when, a, when an inmate gets out of jail and gets fresh air and gets to see the sunlight after doing 10 years in the pen, it's such a beautiful feeling. Product-based businesses will feed you over a lifetime. Save 10%, get a product-based business, be a good steward of your capital, remove your vices, do not spend on alcohol, tobacco, do not spend on the things that kill you. Think long-term in terms of investments and also, Spend wisely on consumables, things like toilet paper. You should always buy in bulk because you're getting a better price per unit. That's how a businessman thinks. Oh yeah, and get a woman who's an asset. It is.